everyone. Welcome to Toy Break, episode 240. I'm Aileen. I'm George. I'm Holly. I'm John Jay. I think you mean your pink hair don't care. I'm <laughs> pink hair don't care. Yeah. Wow, so that's, that's my new favorite hashtag. <laughs> Pink hair, don't care? Yep. Yeah. All right. That's Holly's hashtag. Yeah, get involved. <laughs> so thank you for coming to the show and being on the couch. Thanks for having us. Right. We're going to tell everybody about Toy Break, and then we're going to tell them why you're here. Okay. Nice. Actually, Thanks, you're probably going to tell them why you're here, because yeah. you're way better at it than we, we are. <laughs> so in case you're wondering, Toy Break is your weekly internet show all about the wonderful world of toys, including but not limited to designer vinyl, plush, action figures, collectibles, events, how-tos, uh, guests, artists, events, anything that we can get our hands on in said wonderful world of toys. Let's start by thanking our site sponsors, Button Lab, Art Attack Toys, Dragatomi, Tenacious Toys, Puppet Heap, A World of Stories on Your Hand, Fuzzy Balls Apparel, ESC Toy, ESC Toy, More Art Than Toy, Superpower Collectibles, <laughs> DKE Toys, Mr. Toast, 3D Retro, Pay Saber, Grumpy Bert, Happy Panda Toys, Black Sheep Button Company, and that was the last one. <laughs> <laughs> nice, good Smooth. ending. Smooth. Yes. Good ending. <laughs> we also have a couple donations to thank for. So thank you to Jillian from Canada, Adam from Japan, Squire from Kentucky, and I hope I'm pronouncing this right, Yanni from Finland? Yeah, that's right. Finland! That's nice. Yeah, nice. Finland on the nice. map! Awesome. We're slowly overtaking. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Toy break. We just need a viewer in every Everywhere. country. Toy break right. the world. Yeah. Whoa. That was like half the planet. <laughs> <laughs> Toy break the, the world. world. <laughs> Evil genius. So could you tell us about any contests going on, George? It's a signed Matt Groening contest. To enter, go to the for the contest section on the forum and tell us your favorite Simpsons character. It's that easy. Excellent. And I believe they have about a day. Okay. So do it right one now. day. So don't <laughs> so dilly you're watching dally. this tomorrow, you exactly. missed it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. if this is on Sorry. catch up it's done oh. so just, you need the little banner at the bottom no repeat this is repeat do not vote you'll still be charged <laughs> ten dollars every time you text you should, no. yeah. <laughs> right you should do that that's I wonder how you set that up I, I think know. it's quite easy we'll Google it, it from Canada we'll or Nigeria we'll or something we'll Google you can just, yeah. there's gotta be a way did you say what day that ends November 21st just in case they were curious or if they missed it alright so in the news We have you guys. Hey. <laughs> nice. well, apparently Fonzie is yeah. on the couch now. <laughs> so you guys were in town for Designer Con, among yeah. other things. Yes. And maybe some other events <clears throat> that when you see it, it's already happened, but yeah. it hasn't happened for us yet. Magic of time travel. Yeah. Yeah. And such things. So what did you guys think of the show this year? Designer Amazing. Con. Had such a good time. Did you? Yeah, really good. Brilliant. Really busy. It was just really awesome. Good. Just so many more people, so many more vendors, yeah. just a whole mix. You really hit across the whole the whole area of it. There was everything yeah. there. And we told um, them they had to say nice things or we wouldn't let like them. Yeah, out. we just yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no, really but no, it was no, it was just awesome. Like it was oh, I was just nice. amazed. So um, you know, obviously it was ever so even better than last year and presumably it's gonna be even better next yeah. year. So. I hope so. Two days. Yeah. 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 It'll be nice though because you don't have to break down the same day. Yes, yeah, that's, true. that's cool. You know, Although you know that, like, because we fit pressure. everything in a suitcase, we yes. like we fold up in like six minutes. Yes. That is You guys it. were out of there. We're just gone. You went ding 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 Well another bonus of plus you're not gonna hurt it. You just no. you know, throw it in the suitcase. We, we, Squish uh, them down in the suitcase, wheel it out, done. You go, yeah, you know, <laughs> go, go, get some go food. to the party. Yeah, no, just go and start eating. That's the yeah. best. Oh, that's true. That's true. Eating is important. Yeah. So, speaking of plush and things that you had at DesignerCon, mm, hmm, yeah. What did you have? Why are you here? Who are you? Um, <laughs> well, I'm Holly. I run KV, which is like my own plush toy line. I guess, um, what do we have? At DesignerCon, we had Gentleman KV. Adorable. George is modelling here. He's really fancy. So everyone got the first chance to buy him at DesignerCon. And then we have a few left that are going to come with us to KV's uh, American Cousins show on Saturday. And then if there's any which left... Which already happened and we'll there's none on, left which is totally sold out. It's sold out. It was amazing. <laughs> we missed the best show ever. So I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> But they can find out more about these and future releases at heykv.com. That's very good. You're better, better <laughs> at this than me. It's my job. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. Excellent. And you also have, you just spoke about Americans, uh, KV's American Cousins. Yes. Which is what? Well. I know it already happened, but people might want to see what they could have had. <laughs> and maybe watch for what you next missed time. Out what on. you missed out on. It was a show. Um, we did a similar thing in London last year. Um, where we got... Him? 
um, a load of artists to design cavies and then I've made them into plushes. So we've done it again this year That's with American nice. artists and um, we've got 12 artists, they've each designed a KV and then I've made it into a one-off plush and we're going to have them all together in a big show. A dwarf ball! I know. Oh, I didn't know there was a magnet. Yeah. Yeah. You can feel that, can't you? This is amazing. I thought that was attached for some reason. I don't yeah. know why I thought that. <laughs> Look at the secrets you learn on Toy Break. Oh. Oh, oh, does it work? Look at that. Oh, Shazam. Magic. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> but these are fantastic. So you collaborated with all these people. You made yeah. all these KV. I mean, just fantastic. Yeah. So let's name some of the guys. Like, here's yeah. Skep, 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 Skep one. 1. Obviously, Luke Chu. Obviously. Uh, bloody little, Head. Little Ruff. Dickensian Ruff. Who do we got here? That's Camilla Dierico. Wow. Look, look at how cute. Totally, yeah. totally looks like it. And the little ears are even little guys. Little, yeah, uh, yeah. Curl? Yeah. Curl? Cur uh, uh, curl. Yeah, is that how you yeah. say it? I think yeah, so. yeah. Uh, 64, 64 colors. 64 colors. 64 colors. Don't know how they did that on the back, but it's awesome. I just cut it out with felt and a scalpel. There's That's no, it? There's no, no secret. secret. It just took ages. It's <laughs> supposed to be like, it takes hours. You could Ooh. never. Oh, no, yeah. It does three. take hours. There's There's no just no with a scalpel. No, <laughs> no, no normal person would do it. No sane, <laughs> no sane person. Well, I think that one's pretty insane, but the one's got to go to managing to do Angry Robots' tag. Yeah. Um, don't know how you do it. In felt. I'm there still not. I watched it happen and I don't know how that <laughs> how that came about. It's it's mind-blowing. Uh, this so, one, Chris in my Rhyniax, head, You have like an um, army of little Which Chris hands. told us at Design yes. Con. <laughs> Again, the guinea pigs yes. working. Come on, pigs. Uh, he actually forgot to cast that one. So that is a literally one of one. <laughs> will never be repeated anywhere. So that's pretty. So then uh, the bum. He's got a yeah. good bum. So oh, he's in his KV suit. So cute. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, O'Neill design. Yeah. It's Glios. It's not Glios cool. compatible. But, uh, <laughs> that's no. coming next. Yeah, that, gonna, oh, okay. Okay. Next, we'll work that one That'd out. That'd be Osmi's shovel. He <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yeah. yeah. just sits on top. You could chuck it you at could... your Glios. Yeah, oh. yeah. It's like it a makes Glios it a game. bomb. Yeah. Uh, of course, Scott's friend fun. of the show. Friend of the show. <laughs> Scott Tolson. So look at the look at that tie. He I wins know. for biggest accessory. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's done oh, what I do, try and use up loads of space. That's the way to do it. It's got the little wire in yeah, it. Yeah, so you it. can bend it how you want it. That's awesome. Fantastic. Yeah. Um, Scott needs to make those ties so we can all buy them. Yeah. Oh, that's great. That'd be cool. He does. Get on it, Scott. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we know you're watching. <laughs> <laughs> so this is Drill, Drill One. Um, Drilloni. Uh, Drilloni, yeah. <laughs> Um, so he's got his uh, nice little detail with the gas masks and uh, obviously the drill That's rust, nice. even though it's in plush. Drust. Drust. <laughs> oh yeah, I like it, drust. drust. We've got crust in England, which is Chris Rose rust. <laughs> oh. oh, yes. So they can have some sort of, those guys should definitely do a show. Crust, so crust and drust. And drust. That's Cru it. Rusty, crusty, drust. Rusty, crusty, drusty. <laughs> They'll come up with it. Uh, uh, I think they'll have a better name than that. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> maybe. Uh, that's the Beast Brothers. Uh -huh, um, beautiful. That work on the back. Yeah, so that's got the rather cool uh, ribbon work. And, of course, Heathrow. <laughs> um, he from Frank. He's so, the least cavey, though. Least cavey, okay. but I think <laughs> yeah. something similar might happen to him, or has already happened to him, as happened to the Doc A one, which someone will want the set. Because Doc A did uh, yes. Raptor, yeah. which you nice. couldn't... That yeah. was it. You had to have it. There's oh, no don't one. forget Mocky Mocky. This is the only one um, that I actually didn't make. This is um, this you girl. Can tell. <laughs> <laughs> this, um, I saw this you girl's work. Uh, we went to Pictoplasma in Berlin one year, and she had this whole knitted show, and I just completely fell in love with it. So when I realised I was going to do a show, I just emailed her like, "Please do something for my show." It's so huge. I didn't make this one, but it's so cute. I want that one for myself. I know, look, so small. <laughs> so cute. And yeah. you can't tell in pictures because, I mean, you kind of think like, oh, mm -hmm. perspective, this and that. But he's yeah. huge. Just, huge. Just, yeah. just a giant one. Yeah. <laughs> Fantastic. And so, I like the way you guys did this where it started on eBay and then it ends the night of the show. Yeah. So everybody's yeah. bidding up until then. We've got yeah. it up on now. Uh, They're all out of my price range already. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they went crazy. I mean, I've done some, uh, te we've got some technical jiggery pokery going on, so they'll be scrolling live at the at the mm -hmm. actual event, so uh, right, this yeah. just happened. So they were scrolling That's live. That's what they were. <laughs> it, was a, it was like yeah. magic. It was like it was magic, beautiful. you know, so we did yeah. that. So that was job, uh, another sorry, thing job. we took from London. So that yeah. was, That's it awesome. was quite funny. And it's quite fun because all the artists can't resist seeing their own prices. They're all yeah. trying to pretend yeah. like they yeah. don't Are care. Are you kidding? I'd be at my phone going, how much? Uh, how much? Bidding on your own yeah, one. Right. <laughs> yeah. No way. I'd be like, mine's up to what? <laughs> so, uh, yeah. yeah. So that's fun. cool. That's fantastic. Yeah. What a, a project to put together. Yeah. Well, it's been a whole year pretty much in the making. It's a lot of work. 
Yeah. Well, <laughs> it's the only custom yeah. show where you make all your own. No, custom. what kind of an idiot would come up with this idea? Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, no, I'll just do all the work. It's <laughs> yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, it's also interesting because when you do a run, let's say you did some with Scott Tomlinson, mm -hmm. and but you only got to work with one artist, not that yeah. that's bad. But this way, look at the, the breadth of artists that you were able to collaborate and, with. And people design things that I would never think of to do myself because they're complicated oh, the or whatever. Yeah, yeah. I, I wouldn't <laughs> give myself that to do. So it's great, get new things. But um, each one of the artists actually designed a print, especially for the show as well, like oh, a great cool. big large format print. So yeah, honestly, all their designs are amazing. They did such a um, good job. And Yeah, they'll be on sale at the show, at the show. and online afterwards if there's yeah. any left. Oh, but that's there's awesome. only 10 of yeah. each, so. Hey, KB. Yeah. Yeah. Um, you have yes. to go and yeah. watch hey, She always that. has crazy like releases happening and events are going on. Yeah. Yeah. Birthday busy. parties for KB. Pretty busy. <laughs> well, we like to treat the little guy, you know, he's cute. But there's, there's something the else party. you have. Yeah. Oh, there is something else that I have. Would you like to tell everyone? One about that at uh, vinyl KV coming oh! soon. So here we've got a bunch of them. I actually, I literally got these are the test They're poles so straight from the factory, and I got them the morning that we flew out. So there so you go. So you're just sitting on the plane going, "Hot oh of the breath." I literally, they've been in my handbag the whole time. Like, oh. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> they are amazing. If you told me you were making vinyl KV, I would have mm -hmm. said, eh. "Yeah, <laughs> okay, yeah." Couldn't have imagined it being this adorable. Yeah. Well, my friend Ali did the sculpt for me, and so. he just did such a phenomenal job. They're just well, amazing. You think, okay, basic shape. That's mm -hmm. great. Yeah. But then you put so much character He's to it. He's got so much personality. What, what so did you call cute. his little... Oh, a little pudgy lump. <laughs> <laughs> pudgy lump. <laughs> He's kind of tilted off the How come side? when they're, they're on so me, happy. they're not cute? Yeah. But when they're yeah. on yeah. 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 Adorable. Yeah. adorable pudgy lumps. <laughs> But you also did something that I think you're probably the oh, first yes. person, possibly the first person in the world, I think. Let's say. And if so we'll go with that. <laughs> they're going to go with universe. Definitely the first person in the yeah. world. <laughs> you put plush tags on your vinyl. Yeah, I just thought it would be a nice little touch. And uh, yeah, I had them specially made in tiny size, because really? if you compare them to a normal oh, yes, yeah. KV label, they're what, the half the size. Adorable. Teeny they're hand size. they're portable. Yeah, KVs. fit in your palm. So freaking cute. <laughs> so, cute. so many <laughs> custom options too. Yes. Yeah. If people are looking for things to custom. They so do get. you have a price point or when they're going to be out or uh, any more information on them? We're hoping that to get them in time for Christmas. I think oh, they're wow. actually all on a ship now going to England. Yeah, so. Slow yeah. boat. Yeah. Yep. yeah. So hopefully in time for Christmas. <gasps> oh. oh. Yeah. Fantastic. Again, heykv.com. There you go. Yeah, there. Check it out. So yeah. basically, just I'm gonna put this out there now. Just sign me up for a subscription. Yeah. <laughs> anytime a color well, comes they, in, they may well we, we just with, with the kind know. of the, the interest that they got a designer card. I think there may be that may be a valuable <laughs> option to put yeah, up because people went crazy should. for them. Yeah. So um, yeah. you just just send as soon as it gets to you guys, <laughs> we'll just put it in a box, out. Just send, send it, it, and then put straight. a PayPal note in yeah. there like this is how much you owe me. It's already coming, and I'll pay it. Just have it. Or if you want to do do something nice for the international people, maybe save us and do it like once every three months. Yeah. Yeah, we'll just send you yeah, the big whole, uh, the big, the big we'll like, all right, just, just bill us. Just, I just yeah. don't want to miss a single color. <laughs> <On an account. laughs> I got to tell you, though, back to the sculpt on this, like, it's it's super subtle, and I don't know if you can even see it on there, but when you see these in person, like, not just that little pudgy lump, mm -hmm. sorry, yeah. it, but, like, <laughs> the, like, the light texture that goes over the whole thing, and, the, yeah. like, the little cheek, like, yeah. just yeah. the little puffy cheeks, and, like, the indent for the <laughs> face, <laughs> like... It's all yeah. like and just the KV's perfect a amount of like <laughs> movement Almost to certainly. it. He's, yeah. he's just put real life into a, into yeah. what's a simple shape. So yeah, yeah I mean, you, know, you, look at, you look at this, you're like, oh, I'm gonna get this in a in a yeah. final form. But it's like it's got so much little. There's such little nuances and character to it. That's just perfect. So the sculptor did a great job on yeah, it. Yeah, I'm not just saying this because you're friends, but I think you achieved what so few do is you tran you transcended mediums. Yeah, well, well it's it's, you, its own you, new thing. It stands alone. Like, but it's the same thing. You yeah. look at it, and you go, yes, of course that's caving. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like that's incredible. Yeah. Congratulations, he did just... a fantastic <laughs> job. If I had a hat, hats off to you. Yeah, yeah. So, the, the, the tiny hats hat. off to you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because tiny hats are the best hats. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. So aside from all this exciting stuff that's happening uh -huh. at HeyKV.com, yeah. you might have noticed... You've got someone who you probably have no <gasps> idea is on the couch <laughs> <laughs> and why I'm here. So, um, no, the reason is, as we're all wonderfully sporting, is um, myself, along with two other guys, um, Ben uh, Hart, who's very big on your forums. Yes. Uh, is he Vinyl Hammer on your forums? As... He is right. on Kid Robot. Okay. I think he is. Yeah. 
Uh, and Barry, Don Barry Donnell, who uh, runs The Hang Gang, which if you're anywhere in Europe, or to be honest, the world, is one of the best online toy retailers. I've got to give him a plug. Yeah, so he cool. gets loads of stuff, especially in Europe and Kaiju and things like that, which we struggle with a lot. So cool. go check him out. But the three of us, um, about, well, God, about eight, six, seven months ago now, uh, after a bizarre phone call, uh, decided that we were going to put on uh, ToyCon UK. Uh, actually, I started thinking about it after I got back from DesignerCon last year because I was just yeah. so jealous Infecting that the world. Yeah. there was this thing in the States where everyone could get together and it was so chilled and friendly and so much about the artists that I thought, well, hey, hang on, why can't we have one of those in the UK? And I have no skill with the toys or the painting, so... Uh, event management seemed like the the logical High five step. On that. High five yeah, me too. <laughs> we were having this right discussion there. at DesignerCon, so <laughs> yeah. this is so we get in. So um, we put it together. Um, it's on April the sixth next year. Um, it's in London in Kensington. Um, we've put together. We've got uh, 35, 40 exhibitors um, oh, coming nice. along. You can check them all out at www.toyconuk.com. Uh, they've all got bios up um, about the exhibitors um, and there will be more information about their exclusives and what's coming on, but everything about it's up there. Um, we put it together, the idea um, as it was our first year is we've deliberately kept it uh, very small and intimate. Um, everyone in the whole place has the same size booth. There was no choice. Nice. Okay. There was one or nothing, basically. It's so much easier that way just for... Um, well, we just, yeah. we wanted it to be that it's not about you know kind of how clever you you know everyone's got the same so let's let's see what everyone can do with that and it's right. not we're not pushing anything forward you know there's no there's no one coming in with you know huge booths and taking it over it's all about for us getting the artists and you know empowering them to get some get some products out and in front of people so yeah so oh, cool. you know it should be uh, should be really good the yeah, the artist lineup's ridiculous kind of it's it's literally anyone from the UK and Europe that you'd want to see <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, we were blown away by the support from that so uh, yeah from all the the artists to all um, yeah they're just going to make it a fantastic thing um, tickets are still on sale so uh, again they're at toyconuk.com uh, how much are tickets tickets are 12 pounds uh, including the booking fee um, and that, that obviously doesn't, gets you entry crazy. entry all day um, and it also uh, we've got numerous talks and workshops going you're on you're supposed to say they're only 12 pounds I did say yeah. they're only oh, <laughs> you no. the, oh, oh, okay. 12 pounds they're only 12 pounds <laughs> um, you're getting way more value than that so no but there's, uh, there's the talks and the workshops going on with loads of the artists oh, that are great. involved um, yeah, question and answer sessions. There's probably going to be a customs workshop um, in, in one way or another, um, uh, with uh, the different guys. So we're, we're hoping to cover all the bases. And uh, yeah, should, it's going to be absolutely awesome. That's um, fantastic. I'm yeah, so excited. It's going to be good. Yeah, so really, uh, Make sure really you big have buzz. somebody filming and taking pictures. We yes, will we definitely. That's something we learned in yes. this situation. We were like, there will, we need yeah. film from our yes. show. <laughs> that, will, that will definitely be happening yeah. Yeah. Yeah, to share. So, um, you already know what you're doing. I don't know why well, you're you know, We'll be good. But uh, yeah, so if you're in UK, Europe, anywhere, get, get yourself down there. Um, if you're anywhere, awesome. go. anywhere, go. Yeah, we've <laughs> yeah, even we've been go. amazed at DesignerCon. We've got there's people flying in from the states for it, so uh, yeah. that's pretty awesome. I know a few of those people who are flying. Yes. In. So uh, Spanky, Spanky, Spanky's coming, coming and coming. Uh, a few of the guys. So there's also might be some surprise exhibitors popping up, but oh, we'll yeah. uh, we'll say no Hopefully. more about that. So uh, you have to uh, keep your eyes peeled on the website. Excellent. Which again is this www.toyconuk. Perfect. Right. So everybody needs to be there, whether you're in the UK or not. It's going to yep. be awesome. You have to come. So that's pretty exciting. Your first year, 35 or 40 vendors? Yeah, 35 or 40 that's vendors, huge. which is pretty amazing. Yeah. Uh, they all came in. As I said, they, they are literally the creme de la creme. You've got Triclops, uh, Doc A, your Unbox Industries, everything from retailers, artists, producers, customizers. Um, and there's also going to be, we're curating a show for all the people who couldn't get booths because there were so many who wanted them, but they're going to do individual pieces. So there will be a huge array of those as well. Nice. Um, if you're interested in that and you want to exhibit there, then again, it's hit the website and uh, there'll be more information up about that soon. Beautiful. Um, Talk about the please, competition. Yeah, so there's one more bit. Just, uh, <laughs> oh, just going to well, keep well, going. Wait, um, there's more. <laughs> so to celebrate the launch of the website, um, which actually when this goes out, you will probably have not very long, so you will have to get on it quickly. Um, but there we do done a uh, competition in collaboration with Run DMB, uh, Planet Domu, and John Paul Kaiser. Uh, wow. So those guys, um, Run DMB and um, uh, Planet Domu, Sam, um, who was over here actually mm -hmm. uh, for Decon, they have uh, designed and sculpted the War Tourist toy, which is coming out. So oh, wow. we'll send you the press picture. You can yes, flash please. that up and show it. <laughs> um, done this amazing sculpt. Um, there's an artist series of it coming out shortly. 
Uh, but John Paul Kaiser has done, uh, he's customizing a two foot version of it. Wow. And they are running a competition to give you the chance to customize the other two foot version of it. Oh my god. And they are so cool. It's such a it's cool It's gorgeous, toy. beautiful lines, really great sculpt. Sam does the most amazing work. It looks production level when it's Stunning finished. Level. It's and just it's stunning. Like it's like this big. Really so big. Good. So, I love, um, I love tiny toys and I yeah. love big toys. Yeah, yeah. And it's a really beautiful big version. So that's going to be on display with John Paul Kaiser's one at the event uh, it's going to be for sale there so for full information it's all on our website it's on the competitions tab where there's a big banner at the top oh what you need to do is you'll need to download the template and do your design for it and submit it cool um, we're keeping it it's only for uk residents i'm afraid because of the shipping costs to get it there and back and it's quite yeah. fragile but if you want to be in it get on there get designing you'll probably have a week or so from when this uh, goes out if the closing date's the first of december um, okay. But yeah, get on there, get it, and give it a go. How easy is that? That's fantastic. Yeah, okay. it's Good way to be in involved. So, yet again, another reason to go to ToyCon UK. We so keep I think this is going to be amazing. I yeah. wish you yeah. nothing but the best of luck. Thank you very and much. Please let us know things as they develop. So we, we can, will, we of will. course, you'll be uh, our first news outlet. Aww. Nice. Like we were with the. Oh, we didn't thank you. We oh, had yeah. The exclusives. The exclusive. for the, well. I don't know how many of you watched the end of the show because I know a few of you were not watching and they did not. People mm -hmm. would say, oh, I saw the thing. Are you going to show the cavies? And I'm like, we have been. <laughs> oh. <laughs> like, oh, I didn't see them at the end. <laughs> so we've been showing exclusive uh, pictures, thanks to Holly, right. of the cavies for weeks. So hopefully you've been watching, and here they are in person. ToyCon UK, thank you. You guys yeah. are amazing. You're doing so much for yeah. for the toy industry. Yeah. And just to bring it over in the you know, UK and Europe, that's what we it's wanted. It's huge. Just to bring yeah. it together. We, have so, we hear so many people say in email and voicemails and stuff, mm -hmm. like, hey, we're in the UK. We just don't have anything. Yeah. yeah. Like that your was shows. what we yeah. decided. And, you know, just to get everyone to have together. One. Thank get you for jumping excited. on that. It's, yeah. Cool. Yeah. it's kind of a lot of work. Somebody has to do it. Someone's going to do it. Might as well be us. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? No one else is going to. Well, thank you on no behalf worries. of the toy industry. Thank you. I like to accept that for <laughs> the toy industry. That makes me uh, very nice. happy. All right. Well, shall we on to blind box time? Do you guys know what time it is? Blind box time! Ooh. What do we have today? So, does anybody here like Kung Fu? I do. Um, yes. Do you like toys? I do. I do. Yeah, right. this is well, going to be a handy... Uh, oh, these are cute! So, these are Bruce Lee's Temple of Kung Fu, Series 1 by Round 5. Uh-huh. Uh, so these we've actually opened. We did a, a preview of these, I think, when Sarah we did a preview was on from DKE. for DKE. Mm -hmm. But here we're doing a proper blind box opening. So everybody pick up what you want. There's a bunch of different Bruce Lee figures. There's some ninjas. There's one that's like a monkey. Yeah, I'm gonna go for this nice. guy. I recognize him. Oh, I've yeah. seen that's a I'm film I've seen. Kato. Yeah, Kato. Huh? I'm kind of a uh, big fan of this Shaolin guy. Yeah, he's, he's uh, cool. He's rad. He's rad. I like his uh, his little shoes. Yeah, he's cute. I want yeah, this nice. guy with the big. Awesome. Samurai yeah, he's cool. I, I want the guy below him with the big afro. Yeah, of course you do. Yeah, he's <laughs> good. He's good. Let's tear into him. I actually think this figure is kind of interesting. I don't think I ever would have thought to make a Bruce Lee series. I've never seen one before. Not, ah! in, real, not in real life. Uh -huh. cool. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, gross. Oh, oh my God. What's gross? Oh, who wanted him? <laughs> Oh, oh here you get the gross one now. Oh, yeah, I got the gross one. Yeah. <laughs> He's got chest hair. <laughs> oh. With which, arms. Which Ooh. real chest hair is fine, but somehow it's gross when it's on. <laughs> weird. He's like a mutant Hugh He's Jackman. He's got little afros oh, on. Him. Like, yes, it is. Thanks. He's a tiny weird Hugh Jackman. <laughs> I like what? these. They're nice, aren't they? I love the articulation in the head. Yeah. Yeah, they give it quite a lot of character. They've got a lot nice of personality. Ball yeah, full ball yeah. joint. And then, of course, the arms are articulated. The, the accessories hands. Or anything? No, it looks like you should have got space for one, but there's like not. It, but they're not. I think some of them do. Here, I'm going to open this. There was an extra one, okay. so mm -hmm. I'm just going to open it. Here's just... what I want to know, though, about his hairiness over here. <laughs> so he's got, like, the, the smooth hair, yeah. Yeah. but then his sideburns and everything else is curly. Really? Okay. Must be a wig. <laughs> <laughs> He's actually, he's actually bald. bald. He's just yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. There we okay. go. Okay. Nice. We got oh, a Bruce Lee. nice. Oh, nice. That's cool. Got a classic. She kind of classic Bruce. Yeah. These are extremely stylized, and I don't usually go for quite such stylized mm -hmm. figures. But that being said, I do like you said, John. I love the the ball jointed head. I think they've got a lot of they kind of, of feel character. to them. They they've got a lot of character. Can considering mm -hmm. they're so stylized, it's it's nice. 
quite them. You don't yeah. see toys as stylized so much anymore. No, right? they kind of. I think everyone's a bit more soft and trying to think of yeah. a platform, whereas that's not a platform. Really. I kind of like that they yeah, went out on the limb. It's its own yeah. thing. Yeah, it's cool. It's good. They're nice. So um, if you like Bruce Lee, if you like Bruce Lee's movies, if you like Apples. Kung Fu, these are for you. Kung Fu for you. <laughs> Look at how cute Kato is. He's really like, cute. He's really, He's really nice. Yeah. Adorable. They're just nice. They're nice um, finish on them. The paint is nice. They're yes. like, nice and smooth. Yeah, look at his eye. I mean, that's all clean. Yeah, like, it's yeah, really, it's really, really nice. Yeah, it's just a really nice line. Super really clean. Good. And they've all got, although the hair's similar shapes, they're actually different. It's like yes. they're all, oh, good that's point. all separate yeah. heads. So. You didn't talk about your uh, yeah. Afro guy. Afro with big sideburns? Yeah. Yeah. There's so many people that like, I don't show know. enough. I, for me, I think the figure is lacking in a lot. Um, like all the figures, or that particular no, one? No, like all the figures. Like they have all these points where it looks like they should be articulated. Yeah, yeah. That's, just yeah. Like, I, just, I yeah. want to twist the hands. Yeah, me too. The mm. hands should be twistable. The waist I should. Yeah. I feel like he needs weapons. It doesn't come with anything. And only one guy came with a weapon. Yeah. Even though they oh. all have these hand things oh, like this. I think like, I'm breaking him. I can't tell if he's articulated. They're not. <laughs> yeah. yeah. He's fine. He's <laughs> fine. <laughs> So I don't know. I think it's just it missed it missed the boat on a few things where they could have just. I mean, it's already cut there. It's not like it's a different thing. Mm -hmm. just yeah, instead of just, gluing it, yeah, make it an mean. articulation point. Hmm. So I don't know, but maybe to keep the price point for blind box, they yeah. need to do that. I don't yeah. know. Um, I guess so. I'm and sure I believe these go for about ten bucks. Oh um, yeah, as that's kind box. of yeah. So considering that and the, the different number of sculpts they have on like the hair and stuff. If yeah. I cared at all about Bruce it's Lee, I would probably yeah. like these more. Yes. <laughs> but I just don't like I'm I think I'm there's one a lot of the people. I'm like the only these, person though. in the world who just doesn't You really are. Why don't why I'm gonna like watch Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee. I, don't know. <laughs> yeah. I guess it's the two of us. Yeah, it's just you and me, like, yeah. You always hear everybody's all about Bruce Lee, but I just don't Everybody? I don't know. Everybody. Everybody. If you're watching everybody, this everybody. everywhere. <laughs> Most folks. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, that was Mindbox. Let's on to reviews. All right. What the else? First? What do you got in your pile, George? <sighs> What's this? It's a pony! Would you like By to By the way, it this open? is not my pile. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? It's not your pile. It's the pile of toys. So, are you guys pony fans at all? I think one of yeah. us especially. He I, I've got them all. I'm a real brony. Yeah, he's a brony. I just, just can't help it. I try and pretend like I'm not. You just rip the box. We don't need that. Oh, right. Uh, so this is Zakora by Hasbro, of course. It's a My Little Pony, uh, one of the new My Little Pony figures from Friendship is Magic. It's Aww. a glow-in-the-dark figure. It actually goes for $17 at what? Toys R Us. <laughs> I don't what know why buy it so much. That's what she said. <laughs> That's hopefully not what she said. So this is the Collector's Series exclusive Toys R Us. Uh, which differs from the non-collector. Not, I'm not entirely sure how many other Zakoras there are. I'm guessing because it glows in the dark. It's fancy. Um, so how come I'm going to break this million dollar know. pony? Million <laughs> <laughs> how are you stuck in there, little pony? Take off the plastic. It's probably got a rubber, is there a rubber band. band. I don't think ah. there is. We will get to this pony. Yeah. It's not like you've opened toys before or anything. Yeah, we... yeah but like it's weird the way it's shoved in there. The, Here, the take prey. that paper. No, take that paper. We need... And I'll open this while you're looking at that. So this is some kind of a pamphlet. You just have to... Ah. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta manhandle your Aww. pony. <laughs> she said. Oh, there's a pony wedding and you're invited. <laughs> We're invited? <laughs> oh my god, I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> So have you watched the the new Friendship is Magic? Uh, no, I haven't. Have no, it's yeah. actually really cute. It's yeah. on. I, we have Netflix. I know you guys don't mm -hmm. have Netflix, but yeah, we do. Oh, you do? And we, we have US Netflix yeah, as well. We, recently we found got a way to do that. Oh, Unless so Netflix are watching in case. Yeah. That and we case, do we not. We do not have, do not have that. Not have no. that. <laughs> you mean you watch when you're in the US? Yes. 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 That's, that's, that's it. That's is what, what I mean. you mean? That's that's yeah. how it works. It's not because you've got a blatant hole in your. If you just have nothing to do and a few minutes to watch, it's actually a really cute cartoon. Oh, I have to watch it. I mean, as an adult, I enjoy. Oh yeah, cute. Yes. Dragon guy. Little dragony kind of dude. He's cool. He's cute. That is the friend to. Uh, Twilight Sparkle. Yeah. Sure it is. Spike the dragon. <laughs> Spike like coughs up these little messages from the princess and uh, then like reads them out to everybody. It's really funny. So There's a pony called Rarity. Rarity. That's a terrible name for Why? Like, Twilight Sparkle, Fluttershy, Rarity. Are these stripper ponies? <laughs> 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 yeah. I would say that. They might be. They're they're nice. must, they must be. They had to work their way through <laughs> yeah, pony college somehow. <laughs> 
<laughs> rarity. So again, I don't know why this goes for seventeen dollars. Mm. Good idea. It's like three inches high. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's nice. She's super cool. She's got a great like um, accent on the show because she's uh -huh. got like a, she's like the African. Oh, okay. Oh. One. She knows many Zebra. secrets and spells. In the forest is where she dwells. Mm. So really sweet. She, she has a great voice. It's got cute art on the package. Yeah. If you care about that at all. Mm -hmm. uh, MyLittlePony.com. These are fun. I haven't seen it glow yet, but no. It's it also, looks like it's going to glow. Looks like it's it's kind of like a, yeah, good, that looks good very glow. glowy. Isn't she kind of like the goth pony? A little yeah. Bit? That's why I like. Her. She's all yeah. gray. My, like, my got inner the hair goth wrap and the heels. Like the punk cute. goth. Pony. Yeah. I like oh, it. I used to love these. I oh, the wraps. Millions of these. Oh, my mom hated it. So that's fun. I don't know. So, something fun at Toys R Us. We also have, specifically, do you hate that? Was that a... No, no. That's, hate or that's like? a, that was an awesome noise. That okay. was, uh... Here, you guys go ahead and... This was actually a gift from Dr. A. Oh, cool. yeah, very it, nice. It's even got oh. the British pounds on the front. Because very good. Oh, cute. From... You know, we actually live, like, next door to Harry Potter World. The you can, like, Have you been a million times? Yeah. No, we haven't been once. Because no. it's, it's, we keep thinking it's well, just up the road. The problem is trying to get yeah. tickets has been yeah. insane because it's just opened. So we figure because it's up the road, we can wait. On a rainy, yeah. We're kind of waiting for winter when people aren't there because it's waiting been summer. Rainy day. And they have a <laughs> bus that they just... <laughs> That yeah. just is just full every it, all day, unloading people, like just day. unloading people into it. So oh, it like, looks awesome though, because it's got all the miniatures and <sighs> yeah, everything. It's meant to be like, looks really, really cool. When you okay. drive past, you can see the big purple bus. It's really cool. <gasps> the night bus. Awesome. Yeah. Okay, so when you go to ToyCon UK, you can also go. Yeah, it's Harry just Potter. it's not far. It's <laughs> yeah. right? like literally just yeah, a short train cute. ride it's away. Really not far. Fifteen minutes on the train. You Yet can be another there. reason to go to ToyCon. So this anyway, what we have here is the Harry Potter building the magical world. Uh, this is the DK and Lego book. And if you've seen any other DK books that Lego does with them, they're gorgeous. It's just beautiful reference of all of the sets and the parts. Uh, you know, perfect picture. I, I don't know how else to describe yeah. the pictures other yeah. than... If you've ever <laughs> seen a DK perfect. book anywhere, it's, it's that they're awesome. They're yeah. gorgeous. And I, it's so weird to me that they're in the kids' section. Yeah. Because you're almost yeah. like, really? Because this is just a good book? Yeah. This is wasted on children. Yeah. <laughs> Damn kids, you're getting all the good stuff? Yeah. So, of course, it's a full-color, hardcover DK book. Uh, it's got an exclusive Harry Potter minifig in the front. It goes for 15 US dollars at Amazon.com. No way, that's Use so Use the cheap. toy break link. Yeah. This is awesome. 15 bucks. Yeah, that's wow. Oh, this Isn't that is... beautiful? I, these yeah. always make me horrifically jealous, though, because I just see minifigs I don't have. Because yeah. right. I, 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 I love Lego, but I have a minifig collection, and uh, it's but kind of the closest thing to a kind of designer toy blind box collection I've <laughs> yeah, ever got yeah. and I love it and uh, every time would I... this make you not need them though no like, no need them yeah. more that just makes me go insane and I'm going to spend 300 quid on eBay have. buying a single Professor Snape from 2001 oh no he, you know I, 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 yeah, don't forget Brickling.com I will. I have. I have. I can't even look at that site it's it's removed I blocked it in my browser oh, no. uh, I just like yeah I, I quite fancy, you know, I kind of fancy coming here every year, and if I saw the, if I go on there too much, it's nice. dangerous. But uh, yeah, a friend of mine thought he was being nice and bought me the the whole oh, so history cool. of minifigs book, and I just cried in the oh, corner for like book? a week. It yeah. was just that was <laughs> one so thing. Cool. The only thing, the only gripe I have, everything is gorgeous in these books. Thank you, Doctor A, for the book. The only thing I hate is the they package the figure. So there's uh, one little figure taking up like half this. MP. It's a good yeah. scam. That's why it's yeah. 15 bucks. Yeah. Because it's only it half a book. Like, it's just <laughs> half a book, yeah. But it looks good on your bookshelf. No, it totally yeah. does. It does. I, but then, I still think for 15 bucks, that's amazing. Yeah. Oh, it's, it's fantastic. such a cool book. Look at his cute little vest and everything. Really I like that sweet. little Harry Potter. That's sweet. Really nice. But, uh, yeah, yeah, I've been trying yeah. to think. Yeah. It's going to be gone. What happened to my Harry Potter? I'll treat you for one Yeah, no. But... That's just no. There's been some great Lego sets out recently. Yeah. So. Oh god. Did you see that they got the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle? Lego? Oh, I yeah. saw the preview. Yeah. yeah. I was just like, well, yeah, just like you with just the subscription. Just, just sign up. me just up. Just send, send them to, to my just house send it on right now. Um, oh, that's it's definitely be ridiculous. Happening. So we have Ooh. one more thing. What's this? What do we have? Uh, this is Zombre by <laughs> Ansys Purins. Is am I saying yeah. that right? I don't that know. Sounds like here's a comic. Yeah. It's a resin zombie figure limited to 100 pieces with custom box and comic. It's $50 at etsy.com slash shop slash Ansys. A-N-S-I-S. Check the show notes. Toybreak.com. So it's it's actually the quite a cool box. Yeah. yeah. Like it's and you could feel it like it's all like hand painted and oh, like Oh yeah so wow. it's like printed is it? Yeah. yeah like hand printed hand yeah. cut. Yeah you can Fully see where it's been bent. Oh, that's cool. This is really nice. So then, 
You pull out, this is the little figure. He's in that comic there. Oh, okay. oh yeah, I saw him a minute ago. There he is. Oh, what's this fella doing? Maybe. He was, it's funny because like he made the little twist ties for the feet to hold it in the yeah. box. <laughs> it's from the thrilling and exciting Zombre comic book series. That's, that's had a lot of time and care gone into it, hasn't yes. it? Yeah. The whole presentation. Yeah. That's, that's awesome. And for that pose, it actually stands. Like that's mm, yeah, yeah. I, I didn't think it would. Looking at it, it doesn't look like it would. It's good. He took a bit of a tumble in the box getting here, so he's got a little bit of scraped up paint on him. So that yeah. might be something he wants to address in his future editions. Mm -hmm. Something you learn oh, yeah. with packaging, yeah. I guess. Yeah. No, oh, he's awesome. So look at him. <laughs> the the guys that did the book, they sculpted him as well. They yeah. did the whole thing. The whole I believe thing. so. Yes. Wow. And when you buy him, you also get the comic. Oh, I see. Oh, like, awesome. so for fifty bucks, you get the yeah. set. Yeah. Here's the little comic that comes in there, so you can see him like with the butterfly. <laughs> yeah. Oh. So he's this cute little, like he's kind of a happy zombie. Yeah. And he's holding his little butterfly, like oh. Yeah, what's he that? looks happy. Or is yeah. he gonna eat him? I'm not really sure what's gonna happen. Just his brains. Leave the rest. Just a tiny butterfly. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Little snap. I read snap that. Teeth. Yeah. I read that when it came in. He's a well-meaning zombie, I think. Like he tries to, yeah. like at one point, he picks up trash and tries to clean it up, yeah. and he goes Aww. over and throws it like next to the garbage can. Like I don't know if he just like. I mean, he's obviously a zombie. He's dead. He doesn't know he's doing. He's not doing, so bright. Like, he's a zombie. He eats the butterfly. Like, yeah, he, <laughs> it's pretty funny. He's like, getting beaten up, but he's someone's friend. Like, yeah, yeah it's nice. It's a, weird, it's a weird book. So there's another, on the, this little zombie pin, there's mm -hmm. another site, uh, Ansys.tv. Mm -hmm. Oh, I wonder so if you can see more about it. Out. What a cute little thing. The color is so strange to me. I, like, I like it. Almost like translucent. Yeah, I was going to say, like, it looks like it's see It's not, yeah. It's, yeah. It gives, it's a cool effect. It's quite ghoulish. It's, Ghoulish. Ghoulish. Is the perfect. Yes. Excellent. Yeah, it's a weird. We knew you had. Color. We had you yeah, here for a reason. That's so <laughs> and that was it. Oh. Does he sit? No. <laughs> so right now, these to me very. I mean, they Etsy's the perfect place for these. Yes, I think definitely. Right now. It's a very handmade feeling piece. Is it the cleanest sculpt in the world? No, but it definitely gets across what it is. It's, it's got, got a lot, lot of character. character. If you, oh, yes. <laughs> Apparently it has a lot of character. It does. But if you see, I mean, if you look on the website, I'm sure there's comics on there. He looks just like the yeah. comic. It's yeah. a, it's yes. a real, it translates and the, and the well. comic's quite loose, you know, not yeah. uh, just loose. his kind of, yeah, yes. free kind of free form and the way he moves and stuff. And he's, they've captured that in the, in the sculpt. But as you say, it's, it's very much a handmade. It's very handmade, small but I think it's perfect for it's capturing what it's yeah. supposed to do. And mm. I love the box. I love anyone who on handmade stuff goes to town on the packaging. Yeah. Yeah. It's just so nice. There's a lot of thought has gone into that. And a lot of effort. That's, There's only a hundred of these. Yeah, yeah, which is, that's awesome. This is great. I think the comic book particularly people. is really nice. Yeah, that's beautiful well as well. Well printed and, and the way it's on bound. The front. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's really, really nice. Like they've taken a lot of care with all of this. Like they've obviously thought about it as a whole. Yes, you can see. So I would be interested to see where this goes in the future too. Mm. Yeah, perhaps this definitely. could evolve into a vinyl thing. Or yeah. A, yeah, definitely. Yeah. I mean, it's that, that's super cute. You, I mean, he's got so many, obviously, so many stories involved with him that I imagine you could just keep him coming with different, different parts. Well, of we it. had a bunch of good things this episode. These were all like yeah. enjoyable fun. This one, I just, I can't say buy it because it's seventeen dollars. Yeah, that is. But it's fun. Just steal kind it. of pushing it. <laughs> No, yeah, just, just steal it. <laughs> just <laughs> my my minifigure's gone. My Zakor is yeah. gone. I don't know. Where did they go? Suddenly they're in England. <laughs> We're going home with all these yeah. heavy bags. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so that's all we had for this episode of Toy Break. That's it. I think that's I know, that's it. Oh. That, look at how much that no, was. Yeah, that was a lot. that's it. <laughs> There's like a graveyard of toys yeah. on the table that we've gone through. <laughs> uh, all right, so we do have an event coming up. We have Robo Toy Fest and Brick Boutique. It's a toy show focusing on robots and, of course, Lego. I wish we were here. We're going to move it. <laughs> that Why has tell us about it now? <laughs> free admission, or you can get in an hour early for an extra five bucks. It's at the Pasadena Convention Center, December 16th, from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m., robotoyfest.com for all the details. And that's it for this episode of Toy Break. Don't forget you can save money with Toy Break coupons online at so many different retailers. You can check the show notes at toybreak.com for complete details as well as links to everything that we talk about in the show, like heykv.com, toyconuk.com. Dot com. Dot com. Indeed. Com. Sorry. <laughs> Of course, you can also watch past episodes, check the show notes, like I just said, join contests and discussions in the forum. You can check out the goodies page. There's Paper Toys of Us. There's three different versions. That's crazy. By Alexander Gwynn, Zucane, and Castlefort. You can help the show by doing what you do every day, which is shopping on Amazon. Mm -hmm. Nice. Uh, and you can just click the link on toybreak.com. 
go to Amazon, do your shopping. Now, I think that doesn't work for you guys. No, we're Amazon.co.uk is a different I'm going to look thing. into that. We'll, we'll get yeah, that done, yeah. Out. We'll the, make that happen. It, 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 there's Where there's a will, there's, there's a way. way. <laughs> of course, you can also call and leave us a voicemail at 818 Am I Good? Emails, info at toybreak.com. Keep up with us on Facebook at facebook.com slash toybreak. And I think we fixed the uh, saying that you worked at Toy Break Problem. So if you got that message before, <laughs> don't worry about it. We know you don't work here. Uh, it was a Facebook <laughs> no thing. No one works here. I think it's been lean. fixed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, and if you had said yes, feel free to just take that off your, your employer's bit of Facebook. Uh, of course, you can follow us on Twitter and Instagram. I'm at Aileen Gaspar. At George Gaspar. At A Little Stranger or at Hey KV. Uh, and I'm at John Joe Glynn, which you probably don't want to follow. Or, yes, you do. Uh, at you... ToyCon UK. You absolutely want to follow you. You make yeah. amazing things. Cheeseburgers. Yeah. And yeah. Oh, yeah. If you want to eat, yeah, people. you can eat it's food. Good. Then, yeah, that's, uh, you he, can, you John, you don't understand. So John Joe <laughs> enjoys a good burger. Just yeah. a little bit. Who, if anyone knows me, because I force feed them to you whenever you come to my house. So if you want to come, <laughs> there's always a burger being yeah, come cooked. Come over, this right? burgers. Yeah, it's yeah, it's going to be good. But you, you enjoyed In-N-Out. Yeah, I did, very yeah, much. when you had it. And then you decided to create your own In-N-Out. And I'm just, I, I was just blown away, because I was looking at your pictures, and I was like... You made an In-N-Out burger at home. And I don't just mean a good-looking double-double. I mean, there was brown paper wrap. Yeah. It was attention. And, that and is, you say you're not an artist. That's, yeah. Oh, well, maybe with the food. But that, that was two years of honing that. I actually yeah. think it's better than a double-double. It passed nice. the Luke Chu test, so Which, it must uh, be quite good, yeah. yeah. The Luke Chu C-H-E-W. Yeah, yeah. yeah so exactly. uh, that was, yeah. He's, he signed off on that, so we felt good. That's so good, <laughs> That's Boom. his food show. Good. Yeah. Look and you. don't yes. forget, you might still be able to get our stupid Smurfer suck con piece. Yay. This is from the Suck Lord and us. You can just look at the DKE <laughs> blog and contact them if you're interested in that piece. Go buy it. Nice. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for being on Toy Break. Thank again, you. for having us. Pimp your stuff. Say your sites again. Um, HeyKV.com or a little stranger.com. ToyConUK.com. Um, yeah, every, literally everything's on there. So uh, fantastic, there. easy. Yeah. I love it when everything's online and I don't have to go hunting for yes. it. No, easy. It's there. So easy. Thank you, thank you, thank you for flying all the way over just for Toy Break. That was but it. Also, yeah. there was and a your, couple of other things. Little little mostly you know, Toy whatever. Break, though. <laughs> And now, would one or both of you please take us out with a... And now here's your toy break. You do it. I did it last time. Oh. Okay. And now, here's your toy break. <laughs>